Hey there, pro champions, Bill the Fajita here, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Pokemon Ultra Sun. Last time we fought a whole bunch of trainers at the trainer school, and today we are getting called into the principal's office. So that's the plan. But first, I gotta ask you, what's your favorite normal type Pokemon? Let me know in the comments below. Let's, uh, let's do this thing. So right now, as a reminder, our squad, as you can see to my direction that I'm pointing at right now. We've got Poplio, aka Chalupa. We've got Lexington, the Pichu, and we've got our boy, Grimbly, the Alolan Grimer. Do I literally need to click on him to wake him up? Oh, he's a sweet boy. All right, we want to uh, give him as much love and kindness as we possibly can. No, we're not gonna save our adventure. We're gonna go into the school. I just want to double check and make sure that our boy Grimbly is in the lead because that's who I want leading the charge. We got Grimbly with a quick claw. Nobody else is holding any items right now. But those stairs that that Meowth was blocking should be clear. Let's go. Let's do this. I'm pretty sure that's who we need to fight, but let's, I guess, break into the school and see what else is going on. Uh, I'm really just looking for items. We don't need to learn things. I was, I'm here to, oh, what's up, dude? Slowpoke's yard is a move that can put your opponents to sleep in battle. When a Pokemon's asleep, it can't do anything until it wakes up. So it can give you a chance. You know what I'm saying? Alrighty, teach. Fajita, I can't believe that you beat all of my students. Fantastic. After seeing such a performance, I think I'd like to battle you myself. What do you say? Are you ready to take me on? I am. Let's do this. Good. I heard about you from Professor Kukui. I'll be challenging you with a Pokemon that has a type advantage against that Poplio you chose for your partner. To be fair, Chalupa chose me. I didn't choose Chalupa. Alrighty, teach. Just, just saying. Just saying. Alrighty, rowl it. See, here's the thing. We ain't no slouches. We know what's going on. Grimbly, <laughs> Grimbly, do the thing, uh, aka, Omi's gonna just, oh, just open with tackle, we're gonna harden, right off the bat, we're gonna harden, because I, I just don't trust Rowlet, you know what I'm saying, and then we're gonna bite, we're gonna chomp the sweet boy, uh, hopefully we can get the poison, that would be, oh, beautiful, beautiful, we got the poison, now, uh, if we can quick claw our way into a bite, that would be broken. Let's go. If we get that flinch combo, we didn't. But that's okay because, listen, if Rowlet doesn't, I don't, I don't know. Maybe we'll pound tackle. No. Even if he crits, we should be fine. Pound should get the kill. And if it doesn't, the poison will finish him off just like it does right there. Listen, I love you, Rowlet. You're a sweet little baby boy. But Grimbly, you know, priorities. Emily, sensational! We are. We're pretty sensational. Nice! Maybe you'd like to take over as teacher here for me. <laughs> Joking aside, though, I do want you to take these from me. A little reward. Goodness gracious, great balls, baby! The great balls. Great balls are better at catching Pokemon than normal Pokeballs. Haha, <laughs> know your Pokemon and know their moves. These are the basics to being a trainer. How about it? Greetings, Captain Lilimar here. I couldn't help but observe your battles. You look so very delightful in battle, I had no choice but to enjoy them. This is Fajita, who moved here uh, to Alola from Kanto. He's got a real sense for how to use moves, and I think he's going to go far as a trainer, yeah? I see. Then welcome, newcomer. I look forward to seeing the brilliance of your moves in my trial. Indeed, we captains are the ones who conduct the trials you will face on your way to challenging the island Kahuna. My trial is held in Verdant Cavern. The trial of Captain Ilima. You can find Pokemon living everywhere, even in the patches of tall grass in Howley City. Perhaps you'll want to fill out your team a bit before attempting my trial. I look forward to your challenge. Ilima, I cannot wait to just booty blast you, boy! Oh, yeah! I reported the folks upstairs about that Tauros blocking the road out front again. 
That guy's Tauros is pretty much a celebrity here on Melee Melee, you know? Well, guess it's time that we dismiss you from school, Fajita. Attention all students! Fajita has completed his lesson at the trainer's school! Didn't didn't think we needed the overcom. Intercom? Be good to your Pokemon, and try to follow through with those status conditions, too. Good luck with your island challenge. Have fun, and give your Pokemon berries! Fajita, enjoy your challenge, and be sure to use the skills you learned here at the school. Good luck, future champion. And use that TM! Show him what you made of, Fajita. Um, you seem to be in perfect sync with your Grimer, weren't you? Since we've come this far together, why don't I show you more of the city? Come on, plenty to see. Okay. Okay. Sounds good. Uh-oh. What do we got here? Lily? Fajita, over here! Yeah? What do you got for us? What's the move? What's the, what's the haps? You know, I was really impressed seeing how you battled with your Pokemon at the trainer school. Feels like you're really giving it your all for your Pokemon's sake. I think that's why you were able to save Nebby that one time. I forgot about Tauros! Listen, we will mess up a Tauros. Whoa! Call me the Tauros Whisperer, baby. Oh, if it isn't Lily and Fajita! Sorry if I was scaring you, friend. Guess it's time I get old Tauros back home. But I got an idea. Why don't you give him a little pat, Fajita? Let's do it. Where will you try petting him? You know what? Take the bull by the horns right in the face. Haha, <laughs> you see that? The rascal already loves you. Pokemon become happier when we show them some care. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, the places you'll go, child. And as you do, you'll surely meet more Pokemon and people who will enrich your life. Ah, uh, the Kahunas really sure are something. Able to calm a raging Pokemon without even needing to battle. Now that's something. I mean, well, I like Tauros plenty and all, but it's pretty scary. I don't want to ride on it. Uh, so where are you two off to? I was thinking I would show Fajita around Holy City a bit. Nice idea, you're always on top of things, Lily. Fajita just got here to Alola, huh? Then let me tag along too, I want to get something good to eat. Alright. I'm a little hungry, a little jongers. Let's go together. Then what are we waiting for? Come on! Okay. Alrighty, dude. Oh, how? I guess we should catch up with him before he gets too far. Howly City is biggest city in all Alola. All right, we running away. Uh, just kidding, just kidding. <laughs> that would have been a little aggressive. Uh, into Howly City we go. Ooh, love this. This is a nice little neighborhood. Howly City is huge though. Welcome to Waikiki. Oh my gosh. This place is huge. It looks like Summer's in uh, Earthbound a little bit. Slowpoke's like, no, we're not vibing. Truly a tropical paradise, though. My goodness. Beach time, yeah! Aru? Hey, you. You've come to Alola from someplace far off, haven't you? I can tell. Yeah, what's up? Well, let me teach you the proper way to greet someone in Alola. Alola! You give it a try too! Just like that! Alola! You'll make more friends if you say it. Okay. Let's... I don't even know where to start here. Well, it looks like a lot of these buildings are roped off, so that's solid. Hey, uh, lady. Oh! Alola! Are you here on vacation, young friend? Or are you perhaps a trial-goer? I'm a trial-goer, obviously. Well, you are most welcome to Alola either way. Take this! Potion, baby, let's go! Enjoy Howly, enjoy Alola, and enjoy Pokemon. Hey, if you want to study Pokemon moves, I'd have a look at those unbelievable moves the Island Kahuna's Pokemon can use. Gotta be some sort of secret why they're so amazingly strong. Pro probably, honestly, probably. Let's grab the Pokeball. 
And what else is on this beach? <laughs> the wings will fly and the droppings fall. Oh, I am close your mouth. Ugh, yucko bucko. Let's not let's not do that. Hey sleeping lady. Ground type moves won't reach flying type Pokemon, right? So they don't do any damage to them. But water type moves will wash away any ground types. They're pretty effective at that. I'd say they're super effective. Ah! Ugh, look, catch! Would you stop? I know they're squishy, but that's no reason to throw a puku muku at me! Throw a Pokeball if you gotta throw something! <laughs> Slowpoke really has its own tempo. I see what you did there. It's never confused by other Pokemon moves. It's too slow to get confused or to take a hint. Leave me alone, would you, Slowpoke? You wanna come with us, buddy? Okay. You're a cute little a cute little fella, that's for sure. Alright, and not much else to do on the beach, I suppose. Uh, I guess we'll go into this building here. Sure. Or not. What the heck? Oh! We literally moved into another area of the town. Oh my gosh. Okay. That's what happened. I, I got confused a little bit there. What's going on with that crack in the wall? Interesting. I felt like there was someone hiding behind the wall and laid right into it with a karate chop. After all, Karate Chop makes it easier to deal a real devastating critical hit. Ooh, we don't want to mess with that. Hey, Fajita! I thought I recognized the sound of those feet. Oh, no. What's up, Hal? Huh, so what do you think? Howly something, huh? Well, Alola's got to be the best place ever to live. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah? Hey, Fajita, come here with me. I got a good idea of something you can do. How? What are, you, what are you doing, buddy? Hey, miss, is it true you can get some kind of special gift if you have a Rotom Dex? My goodness, you get the news fast. Hardly anyone has a Rotom Dex, but it is true. We got a special item to go with it. It's our own Poke Finder. Awesome. Well, isn't that awesome, Fajita? You got a Poke Finder. So what is a Poke Finder? It's a tool that lets you take photos of Pokemon. Gonna help point out places where you'll be able to take photos, too. Here's the instructions. Tap on Rotom or press R. Pretty simple. Huh, man, Rotom Dex is so cool. It's like a whole nother partner. I mean, on top of your Pokemon partner. Aw, oh, but I guess since it's Rotom inside, it pretty much is a Pokemon partner. Either way, you're pretty darn lucky. Meet you outside when you're done here. Those photos you can snap, they're simply too cute to resist. All right, cool. Cool, 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 cool. We will not be taking photos of Pokemon unless it is story mandated. Huh. Hey, man. Oh, Fajita, how did you visit the Taurus Bureau? How was it? Oh, we got the Rotom Dex upgrade. Now we can take pictures, too. Oh, what a wonderful helper you are, Rotom. Oh, man. Oh, hey, man. Cheese. Cheese? Huh? Oh, what was that for, Rotom? Go ahead and put that little trickster back in your bag, Fajita, and follow me. Enough feasting for the eyes. It's time we take care of our stomachs. <laughs> oh, maybe Rotom wanted to get your attention because it wants to take photos. I'll stop by the apparel shop to do some shopping of my own. We have $30,000 at least. So I agree. Yo, trainer, look what you got. Yeah, you're lucky, kid. If you got a Poke Finder, then I guess I'll give you a tip. Uh, look at that karate chopped wall. Yeah, it's a photo spot. Big whoop wanna fight about it. Look at that. Rotom says go take a look, go take a friggin' look. Uh, tap me when the icon changes on the map and we can take some photos. Alrighty. Firing up the Poke Finder. Use the circle pad to move the camera around. Got it? Okay, six shots. So let's do this. Love it. Anything else? I guess not. You're good. Just gonna take pictures of this Pokemon over and over again. You've taken all the pics you can in one go. This is some real Pokemon snap shenanigans here. 
I don't know. They all look kind of the same to me. Yeah, it's the best shot we got. It's been uploaded. Wow. Cool. All right, imagine in real life, you upload a photo to the internet and people give you 747 thumbs up. Listen, I'm gonna shoot for 15 thumbs up on this video. Well, please, thumbs up. If, if you're enjoying the video, please, at this point, you've already committed half of your day to this. Uh, just a little bit further, kiddo. Don't give up now. All right, we're done. We're done with photos for now. Oh. I hear it's best to try to photograph Pokemon head-on and zoomed in as close as possible. Okay. Good looks, my guy. That was cool and fun. Alright, Lily's doing that. I don't know, I guess we'll avoid Lily. Like, do her stuff last. I don't think there's any Pokemon here that I want to catch, per se. So we will use this as a... We can't use it as a shortcut. Caution wet paint. Alright. I guess to the apparel store we go. Lily, what it do? What's going on? What's going on? Talk to us, Lil. Hmm? Oh, Fajita, did you pick out your own clothes? Uh, no, my mommy does. Duh. Oh, your mother must have great sense of style. I've always just worn the clothes that my mother wanted me to wear, but I don't know what kind of thing would suit me. But that's not why I stopped you. I meant to give you this, Fajita. I didn't buy anything, but they said I was the 99.99th customer. Uh, here, take this. Okay, a lens case. What does this do? Looks like we have something in common now. Hee <laughs> hee. Alrighty. Well, obviously we're going to be the 100,000th customer here, so let's take care of business. Hey, lady. Welcome. What are we buying? Uh, ooh, I don't like any of these outfits. A Lola shirt. Hmm, maybe it's the pants that I don't like. Capri pants. Let's do some, I guess, black capri pants. Heck yeah. And then... Let's go with... We'll go with a pink tank. Seems like a solid combo. Socks? I, I guess we don't really have anything. Hats? We don't want a trilby. That's not who we are as a person. We're gonna bucket hat this. Yeah, we're gonna put on our latest purchase, of course! Thank you! Okay. If you want to change your contacts or your outfit or anything, you can use the fitting room. Solid. Uh, if you're not sure how to put an outfit together, you're always safe with picking things from the same color family and putting them together. The lineup of clothes you can buy at apparel shops is different at every star. Why to pick out an outfit that'll match my Pokemon here? I want it to look like puke! Alright, dude. Welcome to the scarf! I mean, the apparel shop! Have a scarf. What the hell's that shiny thing? Hold on. No, 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 no. Lady, stop talking. What is this? S okay, apparently we're gonna have to memorize these sticker locations. Huh. Look, a salon and an apparel shop. Uh, you know what? I don't know that it's worth getting a haircut. Alola! We can set you up with ever. Whatever kind of hairstyling you want. Sure, let's get a new hairstyle. We'll get a cut. No, we won't. We won't get a cut. $4,000? Y'all are crazy. Supercuts gets it done for like $15.99. You guys are crazy. Like, absolutely wild. Hey, lady. I've been itching to go shopping, but the mall's closed for renos. Okay. Oh, the more you walk with your Pokemon, the friendlier they grow towards you. Cool. Any uh, items in here? That's really what I'm here for. I'm here for the items. Like, Pokemon are fine. But the items, baby. It's the items that we're here for. Alright, let's see. Can we go to wet paint again? 
They are really shoehorning us over to this Poka Center. Uh, oh, there's uh, our boy, by the way. Ah. Uh, greetings, Captain Ilima here. Ah, oh, so you spotted me picking up one of these lovely stickers, have you? It's a sticker? Ah, yes. If young trial goers collect these stickers as they travel and follow the path they indicate, they will quite naturally progress along the island challenge. Really, if I had to describe them, I'd say these stickers are really safe trial goers like you. Okay. Interesting. I cannot let my guard down. Those Team Skull Thugs have far too much time on their hands, and they're always trying to get in the way of trainers on this island challenge. I'll have to keep my eye on them and be sure they don't take down my stickers. I've actually just had a report that Team Skull is seen making trouble around town. I suppose I should go have a look. Well then, young Fajita, I hope you'll have a delightful time running about to search and collect the totem stickers. Sweet. So there's one. Let's go back and get the other one. And then we can have a total of two island stickers. I wonder if there's like any more that are just kind of roaming around these neck of the woods. I see one. I see you, totem sticker. Oh, we'll come back for you, I suppose. Uh, what is the teacher just doing around here? How's it? That's not something a British lady would say. Come on now. Oh, journey's made by those who travel with you, and compassion makes the world go round. Let me share you with this, with you, young dry goer. We got a heal ball, nice. Pokemon you catch at a heal ball are gonna be fully healed. Not bad. It's kind of great, actually. Really want your Psyduck. That's awesome. We can trade Pokemon. Hey you, did you know about the totem Pokemon? That's not surprising. Do you trial and you'll find out what a totem is. Uh, hey, you're a trainer. Do me a favor. Alright, fine. I didn't mean to say no. I'm pretty relaxed and laid back. Maybe a bit too relaxed. I want to learn a more speedy way of life. I've heard there's a Pokemon called Abra. Will you catch one for me? And if you keep your word and find one, I'll even pay you for the trouble. Maybe. If you give you a Pokemon medicine and uh, Pokemon refresh, you can get its poisoning or whatever else might be ailing it. What a refreshing boon. Hey, man. Give me some beans. Uh, ooh. Alright, I didn't realize that. Give you Pokemon beans. I didn't realize he was going to give us a rare candy for beans. And now who was I again? I'm the move deleter. Okay. Okay, move deleter is literally here. What a tip. Okay, use the move that's the same type as your Pokemon. Then you can do extra damage. All right, let's heal up our Pokemon. Speaking of, and then I'm thinking we should probably teach bulk up to to our boy? Our boy Grimbly? I don't know. Like, it's, it seems like a pretty solid move. Like Grimbly could definitely benefit from work up. Grimbly can't even learn work up. I guess we'll use it for, uh, Grimbly cannot learn it. Chalupa can learn it, though. Alright, what are we gonna get rid of? Hmm. We are gonna get rid of... Pound, I think. Yeah, we'll get rid of Pound. Because we have Disarming Voice. And, honestly, we're gonna be using either Water Gun or Disarming Voice way more than we're gonna be using anything else. So, I think that's the move? Question mark? I don't know. Uh, let's bang a left here. What are you two talking about? Petting a fluffy Pokemon is the best feeling ever. I'm pretty sure I'm not wrong. If you cuddle with your Pokemon using Refresh, they'll try harder for you in battle. Oh, nice cold Pokemon in here. In hot, hot Alola. I can't think of a more pleasing combination. I just want to go over here so I can pick up this Pokeball. Yeah. Is there a sticker in the water here? I need a fishing rod. Oh, my Lanta. All right, we'll be back for you, sticker. I actually kind of like this, this whole fishing scenario. <gasps> sticker, 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 sticker. Hell yeah. That's three, baby. I have no idea 
if it's like, uh, you need to collect at least this many stickers in order to do your thing. But it wouldn't shock me if that were in fact the case. Now I'm gonna be looking for stickers everywhere. Huh, would you care for a little treat from a far off region? A Lumios Galet. Very nice. It's kind of a pastry from the region where my Ilima went to study up. Oh, this is Ilima's house? Homie, coming from the richest neighborhood in the freaking world here. Young masters called the Prince of Trainers School among some. They may think he looks princely, but if you knew the true Ilima, you'd probably call him a fanatic more than anything. He's wild for battle. Uh, sure. Hey, man. Any friend of my son's welcome here. Stay as long as you'd like. Yo, Ilima's got old parents. I mean, no wonder they're they're loaded. They've been they've been raising funds forever. My tap hails a great helper. Sometimes Pokemon are good at things people aren't. And the opposite's true too. Sure. Sure. I bet that could be the case. You got any stickers? This is like all I'm here for. I just want stickers, man. Yo, I bet Ilima has stickers in his freaking house. <gasps> Hell yeah, knew it. He's trying to hold out on us. Okay. Can we sleep in this dude's bed? It's just firm enough and the pure white sheets make you feel clean and comfy. Solid. All right, we're out. But we did get the sticker. I have no idea what they do yet, but I got a feeling that they're gonna be important question mark. All right, I, I guess let's continue our, our journey here. Hey man, you can heal your Pokemon of effects like poison by treating them with medicine to be found with refresh. Uh, actually, let's use Pokemon refresh for a second. <gasps> Sleepy boy, what's going on? We'll give you a little pet. Why not? A little petty poo. Are you hungry? Are you hungry, little guy? Not really. I guess we gotta do some more Pokemon battles. I am looking to get this guy uh, fully in love with us, though. Um. Oh, I see you, you little sticker. I can't reach you. Ugh. All right, what building is this? And why are you being a pain in my tuchus? Ribbons! They're like a way to warp your, wrap your Pokemon up in precious memories. Lots of ribbons. Totem sticker, baby, let's go. What's up, Magnemite guy? It's one of them jobs of City Hall to maintain the roads and make sure there's space for any ride Pokemon. Interesting. Yes, I'll need to see some identification, please. Y'all got a trainer passport? Oh, so you're Fajita. Yeah, I remember prepping your passport for you. Kukui told me to. You came from Kanto. Uh, Meowths from Kanto are a little different, huh? Hey, lady. Looks like our berry stock's getting a little low. Okay. Okay. Oh, hey, scientist. I'm busy thinking about what kind of city we should make our Howley into. It's got to be a convenient for people living here and the Pokemon living here, too. We're going to get married. We're here to apply for our marriage license. We're going to have a lively home together with our ghastly, too. That's cute. That's cute. Getting documents from City Hall is a convoluted process. And it feels like you're playing some sort of elaborate game. Keeping our city clean and supporting the folks who work at the Pokemon Center. Pretty good stuff, I'd say. Hey, Pukimuku lady. Here, this is medicine for Pokemon. We gotta revive. That's $1,500 in our pockets. Saving money. I want that sticker. Hello, officer. In this city, we're proud to live together with Pokemon. And that's why we have so many patches of tall grass here in the city. Young Ilima and his Smurgle are always looking hard to keep the gates around the grass, looking tip-top as well. Captains should be responsible types, after all. I suppose. Ooh, we can, uh, yeet our ways over here and get the sticker. Let's go! Um, I don't know how to get into that grass. Hold up. Can we... Hmm. How do we get over to that grass? Like, I, I get that there's a thing right here, and that's fine, but I really want to get into this tall grass here. Is this gate locked off? Oh, it's not. Okay. We haven't been over here yet. 
what are we gonna find? Oh, Furfru! Hey, puppy! Alrighty, Grimbly. Let's end this puppy's life. Whew. Uh, fight. We're obviously gonna fight. We're gonna hit him with that poison gas, baby. We get the first strike. Let's see if it works. Oh, turn one poison gas. You love to see it. Sorry, Furfru. Oh, no, sand attack. Not ideal. But, that's okay. We got Furfru poisoned. Uh, maybe we'll hit a harden here? That's fine. He'll growl. We'll harden. So, basically, it was a moot swing right there. We're, we're solid across the board. Furfru's still poisoned. And now we'll play the uh, War of Attrition here. Omi's going to use Tackle. A little bit of an ouchie bo -bouchie. Let's see how Bite does. Yo, Furfru is pretty strong. Just saying. But maybe he'll use... Oh, man. All right, we are getting sand attacks pretty hard right now. Ain't going to lie. But luckily, he's poisoned. Furfru is not doing great, which is exactly what we wanted to see. I almost wonder if it's worth uh, just ripping another Harden. Like, might as well protect ourselves? Harden, let's go. Sand attack. That should be okay. I think Harden still works. Let's go, let's go. Yo, we hardened. One more Harden, why not? What's, what's the worst that could happen, huh? He's gonna growl? We are literally just gonna let him get poisoned to death. Because that's how Grimbly do, okay? Grimbly, listen, he fights dirty because, let's be real, he is dirty. He's a dirty boy. Oops, accidentally used pound. Alright. Perfect. And, ooh. Let's harden again. Why not? Why not? At this point, what difference does it make? He's going to die from the poison this turn anyway, right? Right? Question mark. Okay, Furfru. Adios, buddy. And, ooh, 241 experience points? Hot dog. Alrighty, Grimbly. Pretty strong now. I will say, you are getting to be a strong boy. I want to see what this item is over here, though. That's like the whole, whole thing of this. A revive. Perfect. That's two revives. Let's, I'm pretty sure... Oh, walking was going to get us through the weeds a little more safely than it did. Wingle. Alrighty, Wingle. You're going down, buddy. Grimbly. Grimbly don't play no games, first of all. So, Grimbly, let's, let's just rip a hot bite. We get the first strike, which is real nice here. Bite. Oh, no. Supersonic. The problem's chronic. No, no, now we're addicted to Twitter and we're gonna die. Just like real life. Alright, please don't be too confused. We gave him the old bop. The one-two skidoo, Grimbly. You a G, let's go. Let's go. Alrighty. Let's heal up, I guess? I don't know, we're probably gonna get thrown into a ridiculous bat. I just... I got the sense for it. Like, a ridiculous battle is going to find its way towards us? I think. I don't... I, I couldn't tell you. I couldn't tell you. Thanks for waiting. You're you're welcome for, for me being patient, you know? That's what I'm here for. I'm here for the patience. Alrighty. Well, let's make our way towards this little banner in the, the corner here. But before we do that, we're going to save the game. And we're going to end the episode. Thank you guys so much for watching the episode. If you don't mind liking, commenting, subscribing. Again, let me know what your favorite, what did I say, normal type Pokemon was in the comments below. Dial it in, folks. Dial it in. And listen. You guys are pro champions. I'm Build a Fajita. And we'll see you next time. Take care. Keep it classy.